Now you have CET exam. So we are going to learn how to remember oxo acids of sulfur. Okay. Now what is meant by oxo acids? Oxo acids that is hydrogen atom is attached to the oxygen that is O is there. Oxo acids. Now let us see their formula structure etc. One by one. Okay. Now first. Numbers, first one, oxo acid, then second one, third one, fourth here, okay, then fifth here, sixth here, then seven, then complete this one, eight, then nine, tenth, and eleventh. Okay, that is total. We are going to learn eleven oxo acids. Now, next their formula. Now, all they contain two hydrogen atoms. Okay, that is H2. Now let us see. First, remember, first oxo acid formula H2SO2. Okay, then next add only one oxygen, H2SO3. Then add again one hydrogen oxygen atom, H2SO4. Then H2SO5. Okay, now this one. Now see here, remove one oxygen and add one sulfur to this. It gives this one that is H2 H2O2 or remember like this 2 2 2 H2 H2O2 okay now again go on adding one oxygen atom see here H2 H2O3 then here H2 H2O4 then sequence remember H2 H2O5 then H2 H2O6 then H2, H2O7, H2, H2O8. That is formulae of the all these 11 oxo acids. See here, all they contain two hydrogen. These four contain one sulfur and this contains two sulfur. Okay, and oxygen goes on increasing. Okay, now consider that is this formula is over. Now let us see their structure. Very simple. See here the structure of this one. Now in all this structure, hydrogen is attached to oxygen. That is HO is there. That is OH is there. And at the center, the sulfur because it is less electronegative than oxygen. Therefore now see here OH, OH. How many H? That much OH. Okay. And then two lone pair of electrons remain as it is. Okay. Now next. Now add one oxygen atom to this. Therefore see here OH, OH, double bond O and this lone pair of electrons. Again add one O to this. Therefore this double bond O, double bond O, OH, OH. Again add one oxygen to this. But remember, sulfur has maximum 6 bonds. Okay. Therefore, that O is added between this H and O. Therefore, structure is the same. Only add O, one O here. Therefore, O, O, H. Now, remember here is the peroxide linkage is present. Remember this. In this structure, peroxide linkage is present. O, O. Okay. Next. Now here what happened? The once oxygen is replaced by sulfur. Now see here this sulfur double bond this sulfur. Two sulfur atoms are here. And here 2H, 2O. Therefore 2OH. Now here one lone pair, here two lone pair. Okay. Next is add one O to this. Then sulfur double bond sulfur. Then here OH, OH double bond OH. Next, this one. After this, this one. Now, here 2s. Now, somewhat structure is different. Here 2s, this one, 2 sulfur atom. Now, 2h always with the O, that is OH, OH. That is, see here, OH, OH. Okay, then this double bond O, double bond O. Then, lone pair. Okay. H2, H2, O formula. Next, now this one. 
what happens only one o is added to this one that is added in between this sulfur sulfur therefore structure is like this this o then this remaining all same only add one o between these two sulfur atoms therefore sulfur like this this one two lone pairs are there here double bond o oh double bond o oh okay now this now see here here two oxygen more than this one same structure only here double bond o double bond o that is see here double bond o double two h therefore two o h here double bond o double bond same structure only double bond o double bond o again see here same structure here but two oxygen more here also two oxygen more therefore double bond o double bond o that is see here this one in between this s double bond o o h this o h double bond o then double bond o double bond o okay next add one more oxygen to this one okay here add one oxygen to this one in between this s same okay next this one now see here one oxygen is added here in between this that is like this here it is o o s remaining structure same that structure see here all the h are present in the form of oh oh s at the center now see these two structures here what happens s double bond s is there in these two structure in this two structure s single bond s in these two structure this and this s o s and in this structure peroxide linkage in this structure and in this structure peroxide linkage is present remember this one this and this one o o peroxide peroxide okay that peroxide linkage is present between two sulfur okay next structure is over now let us see their names very simple and interesting okay see that this is a us series you know that us and ik lower valency end by the suffix us and the higher valency end by the word ik that is this is us series and this is ik series okay now this is sulfurous acid this is sulfurous acid then this is thiosulfurous acid now here sulfur that is thio thiosulfurous acid thiosulfurous acid okay now here two sulfur like this this one dithionous acid called as dithionous acid okay and this is pyrosulfurous acid pyrosulfurous acid Okay, see here, us, sulfurous, thiosulfurous, dithionous, pyrosulfurous. Now, same, only ik. See here, sulfuric acid. This is sulfuric acid. You know, king of chemical. Okay, next, this is thiosulfurous, then this one is thiosulfuric. Very simple. If this is dithionous, then this is dithionic. Okay. Next, pyrosulfurous, then this is pyrosulfuric. Okay. Now, see the other names of the compounds. Okay. Now, see here, this is a sulfuric acid. It is also called as oil of vitriol oil of vitriol okay next now see here no other names are there but 
First is, it is hydrosulfurous. It is hydrosulfurous. Then this is hydrosulfuric. Hydrosulfuric acid. Okay. Now see here, observe this structure and this structure. Okay. This is a sulfurous acid. If you take two sulfurous acids and join together, see here, for example, suppose this is a sulfurous acid. H2SO3. Okay. And another sulfurous acid. This is OH, OH, double bond O. Okay. Now this H and this OH is removed. That is H2O is removed. That is two sulfurous acid joined and H2O is removed. It is formed. Therefore, it is also called as, if it is a sulfurous acid, then it is a disulfurous acid. Called as disulfurous acid. Similarly, here it is a sulfuric acid again joined to two sulfuric acid remove H2O. Therefore, it is a disulfuric acid. You know this one, H2H2O7. It is a oleum. In the preparation of sulfuric acid, you studied that oleum. In that if you add water, again sulfuric acid is formed. Okay, next. Or in this sulfuric acid, if you pass that SO3 gas, oleum is formed. Okay, now let us see the names of these two. Okay, these two, see here, it is a sulfuric acid. Only one O is added and peroxide linkage is present. Therefore, the name of this compound is monoperoxysulfuric acid or peroxymonosulfuric acid. It is a peroxymonosulfuric acid. It is a sulfuric acid. Okay. Only one oxygen is added. Peroxy linkage is present per oxy monosulfuric acid. Now it is a disulfuric acid. Okay. Only one oxygen is added in this and peroxide linkage is present. Therefore it is per oxy disulfuric acid. Per oxy disulfuric acid. Yes. It is a per oxy monosulfuric acid and that is a per oxy disulfuric acid. Now one more common name to this and that one also. It is called as Caro's acid. Called as Caro's acid. Remember. And that one is called as Marshall's acid. In this series, the last one is peroxymonosulfuric acid, Caro's. And in this series, the last one is peroxy disulfuric acid and it is a Marshall's acid. Okay. Now, the name of this compound, it is a sulfoxylic acid. Sulfoxylic acid. Now, let's do the name. This is a S series and this is a X series. Their names. Now, oxidation number. You know that how to calculate. Just let us see some examples here. Now this one minus 2 to the that is minus 4 plus 2 minus 2 therefore it is balanced by plus 2 therefore it is a plus 2 oxidation number. Here it is a oxidation number of sulfur is plus 2. Okay. Similarly you can calculate in other oxo acid. Remember this one. Remember, this oxygen is a minus 1 and this oxygen is minus 1. Therefore, these two oxygen together as a 1 oxygen that is minus 2. Now, you may calculate like this H2SO4 like this. Because these two together minus 2. Therefore, 1 oxygen less here. Then, minus 8 plus 2 that is minus 6 balanced by plus 6. Therefore, oxidation number is plus 6 here. Similarly, here. This is a minus 1, this is minus 1, therefore this together as a minus 2, therefore consider here for simplification minus 7 oxygen. Therefore minus 14 plus 2 is 12, that is plus 6 here, that is oxidation number is plus 6 here. 
the meaning you can calculate okay now next one see here for this compound here this s it is attached to this s now it is just similar to this one oxygen it has a minus 2 oxidation number okay and the oxidation number of this now calculate minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus 6 and this plus 2 that is it is a plus 4 like this similarly here it is a minus 2 and this sulfur is plus 6 you can calculate by the same way okay now one more different here see here this sulfur here it is a plus 3 because minus 8 plus 2 minus 6 balanced by plus 6 therefore here it is a plus 3 similarly you calculate if this then it is a plus 5 okay actually remember one trick here all this us acid in that sulfur has plus 4 plus 4 this plus 4 okay plus 4 only now here it is a minus 2 and it is a plus 3 now in this series all x series sulfur has a plus 6 plus 6 plus 6 here plus 6 plus 6 only this s minus 2 and in this case it is a plus 5 okay that is here it is a plus 4 plus 6 3 5 4 6 like this okay next one that is all it acids has a plus 6 except this one and this is a different one okay next one now oxidation number is over actually oxidation number of sulfur is either minus 2 or plus 2 in its in this ground state then first excitation state plus 4 and this plus 6 okay you may find out the oxidation number by counting the number of bonds here two bonds therefore plus 2 four bonds plus 4 six bonds therefore plus 6 except for this actually count only one side 2 plus this one 3 and for this 2 plus 1 3 okay that is for this two somewhat different otherwise oxidation number is equal to number of bonds 1 2 3 4 5 6 for this 6 for this 6 like this okay next now oxidation number is over now sorry Actually, you know that acid react with base to form salts. Okay. Now, remember, you know that one also. Here, us acids gives alt salt. Us acid gives alt, alt And ic acid gives AT salts. Okay. See here. A acid react with base that is this H replaced by metallic part. Now Na2SO3 or K2SO3 like this or only one H is replaced then SO3 2 minus or HSO3 minus that is it gives alt salt that is sulfite or bisulfite sulfite and bisulfite here add salt sulfate bisulfate now here thiosulfurous therefore this one this 2 minus H2O2 2 minus it is a thiosulfite. Then H2O3 minus is a thiosulfate. You know that Na2H2O3, sodium thiosulfate. Thiosulfite, thiosulfate. Dithionate, dithionate. Then pyrosulfite, pyrosulfate. Or you may say that disulfite, disulfate. Because the another names are there. And then this is yes, it's H2OA2 minus. It is called as peroxidisulfate. Here it and here it that is it. Okay. It's about the salts. Now in next session we are going to learn different tricks to study different points for sealed exam.